Finally, we have our last guest with us. Uh, mm. It's none other than the delectable actress, model, and mm. all-round media personality. We're talking about Nancy Simenhouse. Yes. Hello. Yeah. Yep, 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 yep. How you doing? Good Cheers. morning. You know, you know, you've you've um, in, in in such a short while, you've actually done quite a lot. You, oh, you're you're thank acting, you. you're you're producing your own show. You're you. Well, we knew, of course, you started as a presenter. You're still the presenter and all of that. Mm -hmm. Putting all of this together and uh, you're getting it. You're making thank it happen. You. You're making it happen. Oh, you know, let's get, let's get a little bit into your mind. I, I know we've had it before. We've spoken about it, but up on from then up until now, you've had your own show. Mm -hmm. How has it been putting yourself, uh, putting all of this together and getting along with your life? I mean, it's been amazing. Of course, tiring a lot. It means um, barely any sleep, and it means putting in a lot of work and mm -hmm. mental work and all of that. But it's been amazing. I feel like um, everyone wants to own their own stuff and do mm -hmm. their own stuff. And doing that and probably succeeding at it in a country like Nigeria mm -hmm. yeah. can be a bit, a bit of a hassle, you know, because you have to basically do everything by yourself. Yeah. But I'm, I'm doing it. I'm trying my best. And I'm just taking it one step at a time, one day at a time. I'll let you know that I followed your career. Um, for quite a while now, actually, mm -hmm. since you started, I know that you started at, uh, was it Hip TV or something yes, like please. that? We yes, We almost met. I was walking out the door and you were walking in. So we've oh, never nice. met. This is the first time I'm meeting you in person. Nice, nice. Um, however, is that nose real? Because yes. it's really... It's so pointed. You it's want so it. It's so pointed. Can I, I have it? I can cut can it you for leave you. leave it behind when you're going. I can, yes. You can <laughs> take it. <laughs> you can you take it. But you have a... It's beautiful. It's Thank very pointed. Thank you I know so much. Right <laughs> so why, why do I feel like I'm getting touched? That's all this long to you said now. Just to point out our nose. It's, it's okay. been distracting You understand? Like, all of that. Then. All of I'm that. I'm like, wow. I'm pulling out career. That's why you did toast best. I see. They're not going to grip for you. Hey, it's the month of love. What made you sound like a woman? I'm seeing your career. I'm pulling your career. All the talk about our nose. Back on the train now. Now, um, you, like he said already, yes. presenting movies and everything, you make your own content and yes. all of that. Now, which one are you first or which one are you today exactly? Are you a, I an mean, actor? Are you a, a presenter? Today I'm an actor, TV host, executive producer, no, no, show one, creator. One, one it's, I do everything every I know, day. Tomorrow I'm on set, tomorrow filming the movie. Oh, you wow. know, today I'm here promoting my, my, my show. I'm also going to promote so it the whole day. To put everything in, in uh, you know, and, and arrange your affairs because it seems like quite yeah. a lot to be doing. Executive producing this show and all of that. Yeah. You know, let's talk about put all of that being yeah. involved. That means that you're the one that gets all the logistics, putting mm -hmm. all of that together. Basically everything. I mean, like I said, a lot of work. Mm. Uh, what you see here is probably just a smiling person, but yes, you don't so. see the person who really cries a lot, mm. like just trying to put things together and just trying to get it out there and, you know, have everyone. But like I said, it's a dream that belongs to me and I must put in the work. Mm. Um, whatever is important to you, you will make important, you will make time for, exactly. you would create time, you would do something about it if it's important to you. So yeah. when people give excuses like things, all oh, this, I say really then it's not that important to you. It might take a bit True. of time, yeah. but of course, I mean, I shot this season last year. It's oh, been okay. a year, and we're just coming back on TV a year after in February. So it shows that if it's left to me, I probably would have wanted to return back on TV four or five months ago. You but know, but I still had to wait for the entire process, for the process to play out. So doing all of these things and acting and all of that, it's just, I'm a workaholic. Mm. I, I've been working as far back as since I was 17. Yeah, so how I really far back don't was know. that when you were 17? That was... 17 was a long time ago. Yeah. You want to bring in that your joke at me? This guy saw me and was like, well, you know, working at Hip Hop World 10 years ago, I'm like, I was not even born 10 years ago. Uh, <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah. I knew exactly when she was born. <laughs> I, I don't want to tell you guys, but I could just... They know. I put it out there yeah. all the time. I'm how, 29, how, how, 1991. Exactly. How does it feel to <laughs> be turning 30 yes. this year? I will be 30 in December. Do I you, cannot wait. Do Listen. you feel old yet? I don't, you see, I don't even have a problem with feeling old. That's mm. such a weird mm, thing because nice. mm. all my entire life I've wanted to be old. I feel like I'm an old soul. Like, mm. And I don't even understand it when people are scared of getting old. Are you kidding? Getting old Talk is one of the best things in the entire <laughs> world. Mm. You know, being young like and that. confused and trying to figure out your way through life is a lot stressful than being old and knowing who you are and confident in who you are. Imagine me as a 35-year-old. You won't come and talk to me in there. Man, no, epa. Finally. <laughs> okay. now, so and I'm like, am I your mate? Now, this is not... <laughs> Rich auntie vibes. Yes, I can't so, wait. Yes, this is not... This is not, I can't wait, though. This is not clickbait. This is not tongue bait. This is a very, very honest question. Please. Yes. Uh -huh. Mas, no, don't make this awkward. Okay. <clears throat> but I'll try. With all this, with all this, with all this, I know what it takes. We're in media also, so I know what it takes to put things like this. With all this, do you have time for guys? I don't have time for guys. 
I, I did have time for a guy, um, you know, <laughs> okay, being, so what, yes, being I, I, in a relationship, yeah. of course, you know. I mean, because during, no, most of the times we yeah. know that people that are this busy, it tends to, something tends to yeah. suffer. Yeah. And most of the times it's with relationships. Why does it have to suffer? Okay, so how do you manage it? It doesn't suffer with the men. The how men get married and travel around the world and it, nothing suffers and the woman still holds. So why is it that when a woman decides to be a career woman? So how woman, do you manage it? I just manage it. Are I you talk in a to. Now? At the moment, I'm not, but I was in a, re in a relationship for the longest time, and I'm talking about okay, so years. I, I have to make a call. Let me call my friend. And I oh, managed no, it, I managed it down, very down. well. <laughs> when there's time, we know how to give time. But I mean, I mean, working, I'm, I, when I'm off, I know when to talk to the person, when to spend time with the person, nice. you know, and all of that. But it's just about balance. I mean, doing all these yeah, things. That, that balance, how do, you, how do you maintain it for other people that are mm -hmm. coming up? who actually also find this hard. Yes, you are doing it quite well. Maybe, mm -hmm. yes, you did it quite well, but you mm -hmm. also find this quite hard. Mm. Maintaining that balance. It's Personal just... Personal life, work life, relationship, and all of that. Pri I tell you, priority list. Prior priority, whatever is important to you, put it up there. The first top three should be up there, and then you just make time for it. Okay. So it's your career... It's, you know, but that's the thing. Something must suffer. And for me, it's my social life. Like, yeah. I don't like to party. You don't see me in parties. I'm always creating. I don't have a lot of friends. I actually do not need a lot of friends, but okay. I'm cool with almost everybody in my industry. That's very nice. I like you your know? energy, by the way. It's so Thank positive. You. It's, it's beautiful. Thank I'm you so much. I'm not trying to toast that again, Mike. Stop looking at me like ah, that. Two but people talk. Ah, <laughs> ah. You both should be toasting with a lot. So all this uh, toasting well, with I don't like it. <laughs> now, your passion uh, for creating content and all, is it, yes. is, it, is it a passion or is it because it makes money? I'm very See, curious. Mm, mm, I mm. love content creation because I feel like only intelligent people really can, you know, create content. And I'm so into intelligence. I'm like obsessed with intelligence. And mm. I think it's what my dad raised me. My dad was so curious about, you know, making sure that I was an intelligent young woman. Mm. So content creation for me, I mean, I have a, I'll give an, a, a pure example. My Instagram page has over 2.4 million followers as wow. we speak. Mm. And um, I'm not really, you can't classify me as a controversial brand. No. You can't classify no, no, me as no, someone no. who, uh, you, you are, know, you're for, for now, thank you're very, you clean. very much. You can't classify me as someone who's dating someone or, or, or married to someone who is famous. So it's basically just the followers that follow me because of, I have organic content or they're organic followers. And that comes from my content creation, the way I take people through, the way I talk about myself and the way I take my time. You know, I believe in planning things and putting things in because everybody can see. So if you're if you're disorganized, they can also get that vibe from you. But if you're planning, it attracts people. So content creation for me is just something that enables me as a creative to get okay. into my mind and create something that people would love. I mean, we're here today. This yeah. is someone's creation. True. And people are watching it on TV, you know. So I'm very sure that it might even be anybody. It could be a young person, an older person, a woman or a man. It doesn't matter. Content Tell creation, as long as it's do. good, can come anytime. We're going to have you around here because yes. we still have so much to go on the show just before okay. it ends in a couple of minutes. Yeah, she knows the things about games now. We've yeah. played a game before. Yeah, you're going to join yeah. us for <laughs> our games today. And since you have this energy, we can't let it just go. We're Don't gonna call me what towel, please. <laughs> Can you see my swap? Please let's that video. Move. We need to get our video. Where Nancy? We just nobody let her go that time. Eh? Nobody should call me what towel. <laughs> no, this time is bitter leave. <laughs> so bitter leave. <laughs> you don't mean it. Stick Why around. do you want to be bitter we're in 2021? And when we come back, we're going to be doing the games and Nancy Sim is going to be joining us for that one. So hey, it's going to be very exciting. I promise you. And they are seated so far because they have Corona. Oh.